All right, what's going on, you guys? This is Kevin, the Full Metal Ginger, and uh, yeah, I finally started working on my uh, blue denim vest battle jacket. Uh, yeah, it's, it's I don't know why it's taking me so long. I think it's where I was just not sure how I wanted to do it, uh, but I think I've finally come up with a way and a style that I like. Uh, I kind of want to keep this an old school type of vest, just mostly old bands. I'm not saying that it's going to stay that way. It could go in a totally different direction, but as of right now, I want to kind of keep it with, you know, bands that have been around a long time, or at least have a old school kind of vibe, you know, something that sounds out of the early 90s or late 80s or anywhere beyond or before that. Uh, I'm not, again, I'm not saying that it's going to stay that way, I just, that's kind of what I want to do at this point. Uh, I'm actually uh, almost done with one uh, side of the chest area. Uh, but I mean, after that, it's going to grind to a halt because I'm pretty much going to be out of patches. I will have a few more left over, but I'm not going to have the space for it. So I'm going to have to kind of, uh, figure the pattern out and then add those in. Uh, we're listening to Massacre from Beyond, which, uh, kind of goes with the style of today's video. Uh, just old school classic album. Uh, this one came out, I, I if I remember right, uh, this one came out um, after Death Leprosy, and I think most of the band left. It could have been a uh, spiritual healing. I don't remember, but there's pretty much the entire lineup there without Chuck Schuldiner. Awesome album. And I am getting sick, so please, I'm sorry. I, mean, I'm, I know my voice is really scratchy, and I'm snorty. All right, for those of you who didn't see my first one, my black one, I'll go ahead and show you that one. Um, I am going to change a few things on it, so unless something comes up and I, for whatever reason, need to show it again, which I don't see that happening, uh, this will be the last time you'll see it in this particular order. I'll just kind of give you a nice sweep there. Uh, the front is pretty much going to stay the same. I don't think I'm going to change anything there. Uh, if I do, it'll be one or two things, but I don't see it happening. On the back, um going to remove Destroyer 666 and Venom and this Behemoth and I, I have a really good idea of what I'm going to put here uh, these two I don't know the, I, I really don't want to take this Venom patch off just because it fits so well and I just really like it as a corner piece but you know the, all the red going with the black and white and purple just doesn't flow so well especially when I've got a you know really nice kind of flow going on besides that it just kind of distracts I think so I'm going to take those three off and just sweep for you. Sorry, it's not really working and it's hard to shoot this way. Anyway, you get it. You've seen it. I've shown this best a hundred times. Uh, so I have a black one and a blue one. So I'm going to start calling the black one uh, Black Jesus, I guess. I don't know. It's me being an idiot. Uh, so this one will be Blue Steel in honor of Zoolander. Uh, so like I said, I, I want this to be, if I did say it, I want this to be kind of chaotic. Uh, I want patches all over it. Uh, the black one is really symmetrical, so I want this one to not be that way at all. Uh, I don't want it to be just all over, just look like a mess. I want it to be like controlled chaos, basically. Uh, I've taken all the buttons out, so I don't have to sew over and around on top of that. So this entire thing... I hope is going to be covered. I don't want to have any blue. If I do have any blue uh, area left, I want to try to cover it up or at least minimize it. Uh, I have no back patches yet. Uh, I do know what I want to do, at least with one of them. I want to get a, uh, I found a really nice autopsy uh, patch, kind of like this mutilation in that same shape, something like the big square. Uh, so there will be an autopsy back patch on there at some point. I don't know about the main big one. Uh, I was planning a battery patch, but then I was like, you know what? That's the most over fucking used back patch of all time. So you won't be seeing one of those. So I'm gonna have to rethink it. I don't have any clue what I'm gonna put on the back. Uh, at least for the big back patch. So uh, here's what I have so far, uh, and I'll, I should finish the rest of this by the end of the week. Uh, I'll just go through it real quick. We have uh, Acid Witch. That's kind of what I was talking about. I mean, they're not an old band, but you know they have that old school type of vibe and sound. Uh, Cannibal Corpse, Butchered at Birth. 
uh, Autopsy, Savored Survival, uh, Malevolent Creation, Retribution, which by the way, uh, I think the first three Malevolent albums are being repressed and re-released. So uh, yeah, I do have a, uh, a birthday coming up, so maybe uh, one of you wants to get that for me. You just think about that. Anyway, uh, did I say Severed Survival already? If I didn't, there it is. Uh, there's Vital Remains, uh, Corner, Punishment for Decadence, uh, Crisian, and Dying Fetus, which as you can tell, I've not finished sewing those on there yet. And I know it's not much. I didn't really want to do that. I meant to work on this a little bit more this week, so I'd have a little bit more to show you. Uh, but yeah, that's all I have right now. Uh, but the rest of the patches I'm going to put on there are pretty much going to cover this. I'll have a little bit of open room down here for some more stuff. Uh, I'll show you what I'm going to put on. And this may change too. Because uh, a few of these bands, I just don't really want to put them on there. Uh, we do have a Massacre patch. Uh, this one, Mortician. I love this patch. One of my favorites. Uh, DRI. Really cool. Uh, carcass. I would kind of like to have an older carcass patch, uh, like before Heartwork, but this is the only one I have. And uh, same thing with the Slayer patch. I would love to have like a Show No Mercy era logo or Hello Waits in that area. This is more of the newer, uh, like a Seasons in the Abyss type. But this is fine. You know, if, I may just put it on there until I get something else. <clears throat> but, you know, like I said, I want this to be old school. I want to go get, um, like a Celtic Frost, a Hellhammer, um, a Merciful Fate, uh, just any, any of that old type of stuff. I'll probably have a Judas Priest, a Maiden on here, but at the same time, I want to have a bunch of old thrash bands, old death metal, black metal as well. I want it to be not a, uh, a one genre theme. I just want this to be old school stuff, stuff that's been around a while. And, like, I may change that, you know, it just depends on what I end up finding. Maybe I'll find some stuff that I really like I want to put on here. But it's not much to look at. This is all I have so far. Uh, once I have this other stuff on here, I may just show you briefly in another video. I don't think I'll do necessarily do a whole update for four patches. Uh, I'll just give you a kind of final sweep there. But yeah. We're making progress, uh, and this is going to take me a, a while to get done because this is going to require a lot of money for a lot of patches, and I just, yeah, times being what they are right now. So yeah, I mean, that's about as far as I've gotten so far. Uh, I will try to update it as soon as possible. Uh, and for the black one, the uh, behemoth patch, I'm going to send that to my buddy Troy. Uh, so you can have that and you can go check out his uh, channel I'll put a link in the description for him so yeah you might see that one again so I'm rambling now as I do at the end of every video so I'll go ahead and close this one out so I appreciate you guys watching uh, I have something coming up in the next video it's not entirely original but it's just kind of a cool thing I have in my collection that I want to show off specifically so uh, if you'd be so kind as to send me those likes send me those comments subscribe if you have it and keep supporting extreme fucking metal